in the market by becoming a wedding photographer. That way, he doesn't have to struggle for clients. He will be simply paying attention to otherwise unknown markets. This is where your customer profile can come in. Belo needs to know everything about the people in that niche so that he can draw them in. He needs to understand what motivates them, what will get them in the door, what they need from him as a business and more. Creating this profile will also help him decide if that niche is actually a good fit. That information combines to form your customer profile, an image of your ideal customer that you can use to target your market effort. After you have discovered the audience you want to target for your sales online, the next thing to focus on is how fit your solutions are for their needs, tailoring your products or services to cater for what they need. As a photographer, can Belo truly take stunning and absolutely awesome wedding photographs with selling online? The first impression is everything. Trust is a hard currency here, hard to earn and extremely easy to lose. If you don't tailor your solution for the customer, your competitions will. You need to work to maintain your brand integrity if you want to stay in business. Customer will like what you do will tell your friends about you. You will get referrals and your business will grow. Step 3. Now that you know your audience, niche, and you are certain that your product or service can cater for the customer's need, the next step is to identify the platform your customers will find you online. There are a lot of channels you can utilize to get started online. Simply understanding social media platforms and the behavior of people on them can give you deep insights into where the customers you need are. Let's get back to Bello the photographer. To identify the platform his customers can find him, he does his research and discovered that Instagram has a teeming young population. He realizes the platform relies on pictures and short clips for conversation. As a result, it's suitable for those individual business like him. This means he can find young or married and about to be married ladies and gentlemen there. He can share his content and when they come looking, they are sure to find him too. Step 4. Just like in every other business, selling online requires a strategy. So your next step in the journey of online sales would be drafting an online strategy. Without a strategy, success or failure is just a matter of luck a complete risk. When drafting a strategy, you start by setting the goals you want to achieve, smart goals, specific, measurable, achievable, relevant and time bound. Then you go ahead and create key performance indicators, KPIs. 